little bit about the vision code. How did it come to be and what are we talking about today? Well, Mike, thank you very much for having me on your show. I love your programs, you know, I love your episodes. What is all about? You're looking for a solution for people. Vision is also our solution for the future. We want to have something greater than ourselves at present. We want to have something brighter. And vision, unfortunately, these days it became some kind of a known, which is equal to a cup of coffee or a hamburger at McDonald's. We're using it too much without understanding what is behind it. But vision is a pure focus on that future. That is a solution on the highest purpose of our life or business. Let's talk a business language. How many meaningless businesses do you know? Come on, majority of them. You know, they shouldn't be established from, a day, from the day one because it's not about just making money. It's about doing something for people. Then this business would strive. And I was looking into an in-depth meaning and nature of vision. How, not just from a point of view to describe it, but to turn it into a practical business tool. You know, how to make it real, how to create it, how to make it really viable, functional, uh, how to communicate it and share it, and how to execute it, and how to grow it further. So it's all about the progress. What is one attitude you would like people to have leaving the podcast? Focus on the future. And one key behavior to do? Kill your ego. And one technique, tool, or hack? Think about decisions because it defines your commitment and responsibility. Ignore choices. Well, we still need them, but not to such extent because choices don't assume responsibility. Thank you for watching this highlight video from the How to Succeed podcast. You can subscribe to the podcast on iTunes, Google Play, and Spotify, or click subscribe right here in YouTube to get notices about future episodes. And remember, whatever you are, be a good one.